friends and welcome back to my channel. So today I have another part of my birthday haul, but this time it's only going to be one store and that store, if you've already read the title, is Aritzia. This was my first experience with Aritzia and I will tell you all about it. But before we begin, let me remind you that subscribing is 100% free, so please click that subscribe button. And while you're at it, go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that I post. I post every single week, sometimes multiple times a week, so trust me, you don't want to miss out. Okay, so let's just jump right into the haul. So I did get a few items from Aritzia, as you can see. Um, I did get one item from the store and then i did also put in an order which I, I will tell you all about that in a moment i had heard about aritzia and i remember seeing their prices the prices are also ridiculous um but since it was my birthday i decided to just take a look there was no guarantee that i would like anything so i was like let me just look that's always dangerous for me. I saw this dress. Um, I have been into shirt dresses recently. They're just so flattering. And this is the dress. It's kind of hard to show you guys. But it is this beautiful, like, rusty brown coppery color. And the buttons only go about... Oh, no, they go all the way. Oh, wow. I didn't even know that. <laughs> um, but they go all the way and then there is this little wrap that you can tie around your waist to kind of um, flatter your waist a little bit and I tried this on I loved the material and everything um, it is a little bit loose but um, they didn't have a size down so I was like you know what that's fine because I love this dress and I, I would rather have something a little bit too loose versus a little bit too tight so that was totally fine with me and the girl that was helping me she's like are you sure it looks a little loose for you but i was like i that's how you know i really really liked an item if i just don't care <laughs> like uh let's see this item um oh the shade is anis brown and it is the Sh wilfred shirt dress i guess aritzia has like different brands they haul that they um sell this was 158 dollars ridiculous i know ridiculous ridiculous but the material is really nice and soft and breezy the shirt sleeve actually has like a slight little puff detail if you can see like there's like a stitching that kind of makes it a little scrunched but it's so flattering and so cute and the main thing was that I felt pretty in this dress and I haven't felt like that in a long, long time. And I was like, okay, if this dress makes me feel this good, then I should probably invest in a piece like that. Because most of the pieces that I get, I try to like scrounge and save and it's just like, they're okay, but they never make me feel amazing. And I don't know, it's very rare that I feel that way when I try on clothes. Uh, I don't know how it is for everyone else, but for me, it is a very rare occurrence. And so because of that feeling, uh, I was like, I have to get this. And then right next to it were these shorts. I'm not really a shorts person, but there was something about these shorts that I just saw and I fell in love. Um, they kind of feel like business pants like that material so i just thought i would just go ahead and try it on in store and it is the labyrinth shorts that's what they're called the labyrinth shorts and so they really cinch in your waist and then they flare out like that and so they look so flattering on um even if you don't have a waist this will create a waist for you and um they have like belt loops they have let's see do they have pockets they have pockets. Oh, I forgot to tell you, the dress also has pockets. That is what sold me on it. Um, my, uh, I was trying it on for my husband and I was like, I don't know, if only it had pockets. And like at that moment, like my hands slid into the pockets of the dress and I was like, they have pockets. And he knows how much I love pockets. So he was like, his face lit up too. So it was, it was, a, it was a sweet moment. But anyways, back to the shorts. Um, I tried these on and they were amazing. I loved them and they kind of like suck you in and everything. The only thing was the pair that I tried on in store was a little too snug. Like I said, I'd rather have 
things be a little too loose and too tight and um it shouldn't be so tight to where it, it creates a muffin top i just feel like that's unflattering even though like everything was like perfectly sucked in and everything and unfortunately that was the only size they had left in the store which was crazy they only had like two shorts two of these shorts left and it was like the only size that they had left and so uh, i just kind of squeezed that on <laughs> and um it fit but it just i knew i wouldn't feel comfortable like i i needed room to like eat and you know breathe so uh i was like oh i want like one size up and so um what they will do for you is order your correct size and send it um to your house um so they did that and um it had been like i don't even know like two weeks they said it would only take like a week though they were like oh it'll be um at your house next week um no problem and i was like okay sure and a week had passed and then um i even looked for a tracking number there was nothing absolutely nothing there was just the receipt that i bought it and um so finally um i emailed them and they were like oh um here's a tracking uh number for it i did create a an account with aritzia so that i could see my items but if the store orders for you you can't track your items which i did not know so um uh, thankfully the the girl that i uh, emailed me back told me and they were really nice about it and everything um so i guess another week half a week another week you know, somewhere like five days later uh after that email um i kept looking at the tracking and it it did not budge like it said a label was created and that was it and so i contacted them again and then they were like oh um we'll try to figure it out we'll contact you in 72 hours <laughs> and so 72 hours later they contacted me saying that they have to do some kind of internal investigation because they have no idea what happened and so i was like oh great because i wanted these in time for my birthday but um you know what can you do so uh i then i think the email told me to call to call the um customer service line or whatever and i talked to this girl she was so sweet she was like yeah sure i'll totally do the refund for you and she was like do you want me to put in an order because i believe that we have some in stock in the warehouse like at this moment and i was like is that gonna take a long time too because that's what the store did for me and she's like no no no, it should be here like within the week and i was like and I really, I mean, I must have really liked these shorts to be like, okay, because usually like when it's like shipping and stuff, that, that kind of stuff, like, I don't know. I just, I, I like to go in store and buy my stuff and just have it with me. I don't like shipping and all that stuff. So anyways, I was like, okay, sure. And at that point I had already gone onto the Aritzia site and I saw that this pair of shorts come in um, several different colors. And so I asked her, while you're at it, can you add another pair of these same shorts but in the color light birch can you add it in the color light birch and she was like yeah absolutely and sure enough a week later i finally got them in and um the customer service is amazing she was like oh i have them i have the effortless sh shorts which i keep hearing about the effortless effortless pants and effortless shorts so maybe i need to give those a try too well i don't know because these were expensive <laughs> Did I even tell you how much these were? Oh my gosh. These shorts are $98 for shorts. Ridiculous. But when you see how well these are stitched, I mean, like, I've never in my life tried on a pair of shorts, let alone pants, that were this well tailored and just so flattering. They have, like, this huge cuff at the bottom, and they... Oh, I don't even know how to describe to you. And apparently they use some kind of special Japanese fabric like a japanese crepe fabric or something i read somewhere and that's what makes it so special i don't even know i just really liked the way it looked <laughs> so it's very very nice and thick and so like i said um i got the black version and then also the light birch which this is so dis different for me like i only go for um like dark bottoms i'm just so scared of staining my like shorts i feel like like if i sit down somewhere dirty or like if i'm eating like even like light colored tops i i pretty much always wear dark colors so this is very very different for me but you can kind of tell on the light color a little bit better the cuffs and the stitching and then it's kind of like pleated so it looks very flattering and i really really do like this material it's very nice 
Um, the only thing with this, oh, it does have back pockets. Let me show you. It does have these little back pockets. And the white, um, I didn't really notice, it didn't, I didn't really notice if it was see-through or not. I mean, you can kind of see my hand, I guess, kind of. But I did try this on with black underwear, so, um, and I couldn't see it. And I asked my husband and he couldn't see anything either, so, I don't know. Uh, but I would just err on the side of caution and just wear nude underwear. The only thing with these shorts is you have to size up, possibly even two sizes up, because I don't know whose sizing they're going by, but the sizing is really off. Um, I even read on the like reviews for the shorts, they were like, you need to size up. Um, one person said they size down, which I don't even, I don't know how that's possible, but most definitely for this shorts, the labyrinth shorts, you have to size up at least one size up, at least, because um, the sizing was off for this. So I did end up going up two sizes, which did not do anything good for my um, confidence. <laughs> um, but the fact that these looked so good and made me look slimmer than what I am, I was like, you know what, I don't even care about the number, which is how it should always be, but I digress. So those were the items that I got from Aritzia those three items so i had never been to aritzia and if you haven't either prepare yourself um if you are very shy and um kind of scared of dressing rooms and stuff it's not the place for you what i didn't know was when you go to the dressing room they have all of these like separate dressing rooms right but then in the center they have like a couple of couches so that i guess your boyfriends husbands or whatever can like sit in the center and see you as you come out because and you have to come out and show them because they don't have any mirrors inside of these dressing rooms which um i thought there was like some mistake i was like looking all around and i was like how is there not a mirror in here i had no idea they do that on purpose so that you will go outside and it's like a communal dressing room kind of situation which I was not a fan of I get so painfully shy and I even had like my phone out um trying to look in the camera to see how I looked but I could not tell and I did uh, after the fact look up at like about the mirror situation and apparently if you are really really uncomfortable you can ask the stores people and they'll bring out like a little separate mirror for you I think um but why, Aritzia, why? Why don't you have mirrors inside of the dressing rooms? Ugh, this is like every introvert's nightmare. Like seriously, like if I was shopping by myself, um, I, I just wouldn't. I, the only reason I went out there was because I knew my husband was there and I was like, oh my gosh. But there was like another guy um, with his wife or girlfriend and he was like, you know, <laughs> it was just so funny to see my husband and him, like both of them, like, ugh, these girls and they're shopping, you know, but um i was just very shy to like go out there and especially when like if a if an item is like too tight or if i can't get the zip up or something like i would be so mortified to go out there but um other than that um it was great the the girls were really sweet very helpful it, it's literally just the dressing room situation oh my gosh um so just keep that in mind I was literally shocked. I had no idea what I, like, when I got in there, I had no idea they didn't have mirrors. So, um, just keep that in mind. But you know what? At the end of the day, if you love that item of clothing, just don't, don't even pay attention to whoever is in the dressing room. Just check yourself out, you know, and ask those girls. Those girls were really helpful. They'll get you, like, whatever size you need. Although they were quite busy, so I, I did make my husband do it <laughs> instead. So, dressing rooms. Aritzia dressing rooms wear other than that their clothes are beautiful Alrighty, guys so that was it for this little birthday haul i hope you guys enjoy please subscribe if you haven't already give this video a big thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next video bye